Hello and welcome back to Not The Mature Approach with me, Dan. Uh, we have a new weapon in our arsenal today, and that is the Mavic Pro. So yeah, I'm really excited about this. We've still got the Phantom, we're still going to use it a lot, but this is going to allow us to go a little bit further with uh, some of the videos and some of the adventures that we've got planned. Um, one thing with the Phantom 3 standard that, that did cause a bit of an issue was the range. And I know that some people get some really incredible range with that drone, and it is a great drone, um, especially in the FCC areas. But in the CE areas, especially in the UK, um, they don't seem to do that well in terms of range, although they are a great drone. Um, but So we're going to use this for the range requirement sort of stuff. Uh, and we've got a lot of ideas coming up for that as well. So the idea for today's video was going to be to go to my friend's house. He's got some woodlands at the back of his house. And we were going to basically send the drones up and follow quad bikes through the woods using the tracking system and all that kind of stuff, just kind of testing it out. Unfortunately, it was way, 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 way too rainy today. Um, it just did not let up all day, so we couldn't put the, the, the drones up because it was just too wet. They would have got ruined. So um, we've done the video anyway, and instead of having the drone coverage, we've just got action cams um, to, to kind of document what we did, which was pretty cool, actually, because we took the, the action cams on the, on the quads. Uh, we did have a couple of problems with the quads, so first thing's going to be kind of like fixing those. You'd be amazed what you can fix with cable ties. So you try and count how many cable ties we're using in this video. Okay guys, let's see what happens. We're gonna try and affix this onto here. Maybe put some panelled sides on here, whatever. And then we can fucking load a shitload of stuff on here. And we can do fewer trips to the fire pit. Right. What are we, gonna what are we towing it with? Quad? Yeah. Have you got the tire on the other quad working now? We've got no. two working. No, got you, the bike working. You had one job to do. I know, yeah. Right. <laughs> uh, probably. Well, we... No, they'll, they'll be lifting it on. So, I it is. Yeah, well, you have to worry about that. Well, it, it needs to on. not overhang this side ideally too much, doesn't it? So, I mean. Like for this piece of wood, for example, I would probably. I mean, ideally, should we just put it on? Lean it on the side it, but... and we'll come through, kick it in half. <laughs> I don't think you need to have that platform there. This. Maybe, maybe you do, maybe it'd be good. This. Yeah, why not? Fuck it. Yeah, I'll leave it on. Do you know what? We need to stop talking shit. Just get it loaded up. Do you think we need to leave. Off there. I think if you put too much weight on this, it's going to snap that cable tie, so we'll have to put another one on. No, we just lie it on the, lie it, lie it on the trailer. There. <laughs> Don't put any more cable ties on, believe it, it's, it's got enough. Maybe like... And then maybe a cable tie. You're obsessed with cable ties. Whoa. <laughs> Give me some cable ties. <laughs> another one. do the tracking and adjustments on yeah. the trailer just to micro adjustments. So we're just gonna do a little test here. Are you ready? Issue with this here. Yeah, let's let, 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 water, with, uh, let water get into the orange hands as well, which is quite good. Uh, but yeah, so that, right. that, that, that's fucked, oh, which means it's been breathing, which isn't great for fuel, I mm. think. I don't know, so <laughs> thing, it don't blame a good, a good tradesman, don't blame his tools. You might want to connect the other terminal first. Uh, have you got the right side? Yes, you got it on the right one? The right yeah, uh, oh, sh uh, yeah. Good, that's safe. 
Um, we, I think we need to just attach that as it is on there somehow. Maybe we could use cable ties. Do you know one thing we haven't introduced to this channel yet? Super goy. Much better. I'll let you have a little guess. Drop tape. <laughs> Try and get to put it with. On that I, bet, I reckon that there, even up to like there, it's not going anywhere yet. So, feeling that bad boy. Why don't we go and see if we can find another little over here? Right. Right, this baby. Watch out for a wheel, it's stuck on the wheel. Yeah, because the bike's been shit in it now. Well, you never get the bike balanced today because it's too slippery, isn't it? So, the other thing about here is. Yeah. Remember, kids, always use the right equipment. So I'll, I'll oh, that's good enough, isn't it? That's... Yeah. Where are those gloves? You are you ready? Yes, this is not dangerous at all. <laughs> what could be my, more my hand, I'm going to lose my fucking hand. Right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hold it up as well. Right, uh, the quad. Jeff. Shall we put it on the floor and maybe roll it forward or something? Because I'm, I'm not getting much. Wait, does it need to go on the other way? Do you think? Is it freewheeling if you move it backwards? Should we put it on the deck? Right, right, right. right no, it'll. Why well, we put it not on that properly? It won't turn. So it, it needs. Is, is it in gear? Yeah, it's in gear. That wouldn't this, would it? No, but it's bent that, and that won't. If that won't turn, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Turn. Uh, We need to put it down. Put to take it out of gear. Yes! <laughs> okay, go on. Go, go, go on, it's nearly on. Right, the chain's on. Right, finally filled up, we should be able to turn the back wheels. Uh, yeah, there you go. And then it's that. Three gears, no clutch. It's got a crack in the front of the block, I think, so. Oil pisses down, smoke gets red hot. The exhaust, because the engine is supposed to be on this frame, the exhaust there burns your trousers, burns a hole in the trousers there, which is like the initiation stamp of, of driving it. Uh, and getting it started because the kick start is kind of like in a, it's the wrong sort of way. You're kicking against sharp bits of plastic, yeah. cuts the shit out of your ankles. Uh, it's just a pile of shit, really. Right. Get the choke on. Brakes on, hold it in position. This is a fucking a this charm is number. The worst thing ever. That was pretty close. Here we go. Yeah. The beast! She lives! This one started off.
start this bad boy back up again. Oh yeah, shit, chain. Uh, right, so... chains! Okay, bottom. Hogs on, little hogs on. Jumped off as soon as I accelerated. It jumped off I immediately. It might be the gearbox locking or something, and it's kicking it off or something. I, I'm sure something went a bit. <laughs> Straight away. As soon as you get any progression forward, it just jumps off. It must be to do with that loose cog at the front. It must be. It must be that. I, I can't. I don't know what else it could be, there's nothing else involved in the function of it. It's, it's that which is rock solid and that which is a bit loose. There's nothing around here that adjusts or anything. That bolt there, that's still tight. Because that, the, the fucking cogs are like facing that way. Mm. It's off again. It's off. It's off. The moment. The moment it gets any kind of grip. Wait on it. <laughs> Maybe it's suspension. It's still turning. <laughs> Fuck, spewing yeah, around. What? Maybe it's to do with the suspension. And when oh, the, 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 the weight goes down. Look at this here. You know, when the weight goes down, the whole thing bends, doesn't it? So when it bends, the chain's going to be coming loose and it's oh, jumping it's off to the corner. We've found the problem here. It's a bolt that's missing. There needs to be a bolt through here. Uh, similar to this. When you start it, put weight on it, the chain kicks off. This is a sparkler. We've actually been contemplating putting sparklers through it and wrapping it back around on itself. That's how desperate we got. We've been looking at Christmas tree stands. Lamp shades. So, and then the last minute we find on a piece of garment furniture, we find a bolt. And it's this bad boy. It's, it's a lot bigger than it needs to be, but we can't get it to line up because the holes are pissed. So, that might be a winner. I think we need to get it on its sides because at the moment the weight is naturally pushing it out of the seat. What about like. Yeah, that might work. Yeah, I'll bend that. How sturdy is that? It's, it's, it's close, isn't it? Yeah, it's not a million so, miles. So, do you want, how do you want to do this? Do you want to, do you want to try and clap it up now? I think we need to put it on its side so we can see exactly where it needs to go and then try and push it in the right direction.
Yeah. <laughs> no. Fucking hell. Yeah, well, it probably will have because that's only fucking held on with duct tape. Oh, we have some great ideas, don't we? Fucking hell, there's mud all over it. Let's pull it out. Yeah, of it. In there. Is it in gear? That's neutral. Yeah. Right, so. You want to put it in gear and put the clutch in, and then I'll push it as fast as I can. Yeah. And then try and. Right. Okay, let's do it. We'll go down there. We'll go get that run, we'll do it last minute. Right. Okay. Oh, I see what you mean about the handlebars. We'll do it like that anyway. Go on, Jeff. Go, Jeff. Go. Faster, Jeff. Faster. Come on. Come on. Come on. Faster. Faster. It was better anyway, wasn't it? It was better. That's sweet. That's. Is that going to be sorted?
Oh no, not again! <laughs> oh, f is the uh, what? Is the thingy still on? Yeah. All right. So, oil on the drive from the uh, leaking quad. Just about got it going again. Um, So, what an emotional journey we've been on. We've had issues, we've had problems, we've overcome problems, we've had more problems, we've had chains coming off. So we've, we, we did get to use a cable tie and a bolt, see that? That's new levels of bodge, bolts and cable ties. This is a death trap. It, it literally doesn't die. I'm not sure it's, it's had, it hasn't had any oil in it for months. Yes. It all leaks out the front when you uh, for a crack in the block. Okay. Tow rope, we missed an absolute belter. So I start towing this because the Daniel over tightened. So here's a kickstart. The bolt here. Um, Daniel thought it'd be clever to tighten up a bolt, a tiny bolt, to the point where he was going red in the face, and then we hear a click, and he snapped it. So we were stranded at the bottom of the uh, bottom of the garden with a fucked kickstart. So we, I went and got some rope, towing him back. I start getting a bit leery with the tow, towing, revving, wheel spinning, the usual bell end stuff, and. Uh, it snapped and twanged and whipped me on my arse. I'll get, I'll get a picture of the bruise later for everyone who's demanding to see it. It is on my arse, so, you know. Um, I think the other, that one was about 100 quid. 110 crosser engine in it with three gears. It's not fast, but the back tyres are bald. The front tyre is coming off its rim. Uh, it, it is funny, though. And this thing... Buckled front wheels. Oh, you won't be able to see it from here, but like you, you, your handlebars point 12 o'clock and your wheels are pointing at like 9 o'clock. So uh, this thing I think was about was about two or three hundred quid or something. Um, 200 cc, four four gears I think. Quite quite fast to be fair, but you don't want to go too fast because the handlebars are bent and the wheels are pissed. So if you go around a bend, it, it literally sucks you off and into a hedge. Uh, I've just rolled it over at the bottom of the uh, bottom of the garden. I started doing donuts. It kicked, it gripped, it dug in. I went up a bush, and it rolled out. I fell off the back of it. I had to put my feet in the air to stop it actually rolling onto me. So, uh, as the channel name suggests, yeah, it's uh, not the most mature way. But we all know this is where fun begins. Okay, guys, so there you go. Fixing quads with cable ties and ragging them around fields. Nice little video, nice thing to do on a Saturday. Um, you know, this channel is all about the lads' adventures. We really want to document the kind of fun things to do with drones. So, I mean, anybody can get a drone and just, you know, fly it around, but that gets a bit boring. So, we want to use drones and that kind of perspective um, to, to kind of record the fun things that, that we're going to do, especially those kind of, like, lad adventure type stuff. So, we've got a ton of videos coming up this summer um, in terms of, like, boats... Uh, mountain bikes, uh, camping expeditions, all that kind of stuff, all those kind of um, adventure 
type of things uh, and you know we want to really concentrate and document them well and put them on the internet for you guys to see so please subscribe to our channel so we can keep bringing this stuff and if you like the video give it a thumbs up okay see you next time